What's going on, man? It's What's Sergio up, man? from Console Kings, man. Nice to meet you. Like it. Cool, cool. So, how does it feel portraying a first black superhero on film? It's great, man. I mean, not even just the first black superhero. Just if you look at any other superhero movie or any other story, like character uh, in the Marvel world or any comic book world, there's nothing like the Falcon. You know, when you watch the movie and he introduces himself as that character and those wings come out, it's a whole different ballgame. Were you a fan of him growing up as a kid? No, I didn't. I, I wasn't a big comic book kid. I was a baseball card fighting in the backyard kid. So I never really had time to uh, read comic books. I was too busy fighting. <laughs> so how would you like to see Falcon portrayed and developed in uh, future films? Um, you know, I like uh, the Falcon and Captain America's relationship. Uh, Chris Evans, who plays Cap, is a good friend of mine, and we work really good together. I mean, our, our rapport is, uh, is great on screen. So I think it's better to have a great movie with two superheroes as opposed to a mediocre movie with one superhero. I definitely agree with that, because I like the way how this movie was more, you know, it was just a lot better than yeah. you know, the last the last movie. It seemed more serious, more real to life. It's definitely the best. Um, I feel like it's the best superhero movie. The CGI is seamless. Yeah. The action sequences are insane, and the story is great. I mean, it's like that uh, Leonardo DiCaprio movie, Catch Me If You Can, yeah. meets Jason Bourne, and you get yeah. Captain America 2, which is kind of like Avengers 1.5. I was reading it, you almost uh, died trying to play the film, so what's up with that? They exaggerated that. I was, I no, I was uh, flying in, and I came in hot and heavy, and I ran into a car. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Some of uh, Falcon's ability is to be able to see through bird's eyes, in front of the mm -hmm. bird's eyes, you know. Did you want to see that in the film, or was that kind of something we want to say for future films? Well, if you look at the Falcon, he kind of evolved as time went on in the Marvel Universe, which is great because Marvel took the time to get him right, as opposed to just writing him off. So this one is kind of like the fourth incarnation of the Falcon. It's a little bit of each one mm -hmm. kind of smashed together in this one tactical expert. So it's not so much him seeing through the birds and doing all that stuff I have on the red suit. It's a different character, but just caught in the same genre of the uh, Captain America world. Well, I appreciate your time, man. No doubt. Love the movie, man. Love to see you more films, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate all it. Right. Console Kings!